I'm about to bite into a scorpion on camera and everyone that ever finds this video can see it, so. Hi, we're the Bullhead Municipal Media Crew and we're on a mission to prove our small community is packed with awesome things to do. To succeed, we're going to do them all. This is our journey. Hello Bullhead, hello Tri-State. Uh, today we are at the Bullhead City Farmers Market. It is the first farmers market of the season. On It's the first weekend of October. This weekend we have the Laughlin Film Festival, the Farmers Market, and then later today is Girls Night Out. Canyon and Quincy are spending all their time at the film festival this week because they actually put a film in the festival. They shot the whole thing. It's like a 90 minute film called Murder Locked and Loaded. And if you haven't seen it, well, shame on you. But um, yeah, so so this part of this episode is, is basically going to be uh, me, Christy, uh, and my mom and Atticus are gonna go through here at the farmer's market. And for the girls' day out, I can't imagine a single reason in the world why anyone would care what I think about girls' day out. So that whole thing is going to be uh, Christy and my mother, who I recruited specifically for this episode, out of a lack of, of females' opinions to get. Um, so they're going to go shopping, and it should be fun. Yes, I'm excited for produce. So Mackenzie told me there's not a lot of produce here, so that... Look behind you. Strawberries. If you've ever just walked past a bushel of strawberries in a supermarket and then just like picked them up and they were perfectly ripe and just kind of opened the plastic container and you're hit with that wonderful scent, that is what's all around us right now. That and grass. I'm going to try a real strawberry for the first time. That is sweeter. Has your whole life been a lie? No. I was just curious, how much good, for yeah. the Japanese eggplant? They're three dollars a pound. They're three dollars a pound. Um, I'm thinking gonna get one. Okay. I just want to try it because I've never tried a Japanese eggplant. <laughs> oh. Hi. How are you? Good. How are you? Oh, you're ready for a good yep. Yeah. Oh, ready for a good day of shopping? I am. Already bought a Japanese eggplant. Oh, you did? Yeah. Oh, that's, that's pretty. Yeah. That's a nice one. Hydrate them and then they make them into the sucker. Are those a big seller? Or? They actually are. Wow. Do you eat You can actually eat the scorpion, yes. Should I do it? I don't know. Are you brave? I like to think I am. I got a spaghetti squash and um, fresh green beans so we can make dried green beans and also Brussels sprouts, Atticus's favorite. So we'll cook them up with some bacon and roast them in the oven and They'll be wonderful. Such a good grandma. That's right. This is um, going to be different. I've never eaten a bug before, to my knowledge, like knowingly eaten a bug. And this is a scorpion sucker. And it supposedly tastes like apple and not at all like scorpion. It's really thick. So it's probably gonna take a while to get the scorpion. And uh, this is a new experience. 
She did it. It's sticky. It tastes like apple. Doesn't taste like a bug yet or insect. What up? We're at Laughlin International Film Festival. Uh, welcome Bullhead by the Horners. Uh, or <laughs> welcome Bullhead by the Horners. Um, we're at the mall. Ow. Outlet Mall in Laughlin. It's uh, right across from Bullhead, if you didn't know that. Anyways, we're here because uh, me and Canyon, our movie got in, you know, because we're, we're big players now. Big players! We're gonna, we're here, we're gonna watch some movies, have a good time, eat food, uh, you do it next year, especially for youths. Oh, are you filming for the thing? Yes. Um, we're here, gonna watch a, we're gonna watch a movie. <laughs> Girls Day Out. It is a vendor event aimed at women and I think most of the vendors are women but I'm not sure about that so let's go check it out. Let's see what they have and what makes this a Girls Day Out. So I've been working on this the entire car ride over here and I think I'm getting closer to the scorpion. My main complaint isn't the fact that I'm about to eat a scorpion, it's that this is so thick, that is so sweet, I swear I'm going to get myself a stomach ache. my nephew with money and candy. <laughs> How's that work? Pretty good. I've broken through to the claw. I can feel it against my tongue. fairly odd gifts along with their mom. Okay, so what we do here is we specialize in custom glass etching. We have other things that we pre-make that we think are pretty popular. So we really do like to do custom pieces. Um, right now, my mom who does the glass etching is at home working on Angel's wine glasses. So we like to do things that are fun and friendly for everybody. So like right here, we have something nautical because who doesn't love the beach? Um, we like to do useful things so you can drink out of it and all that thing, give it a little personalized touch so you're not just doing every, uh, using every cup that they sell like at Walmart and such. Maggie also makes unicorn beanies. You can order from us online, but it's still, it's more personalized and more loved, is what I would say. Yeah. All right, I think that's everything you need to know about Fairly Odd Gifts. Okay. Uh, Facebook page and Instagram, and Instagram. Fairly okay. Odd Gifts. Yeah. Alright, so you can find them there, and I'm biased, but I think they make amazing stuff. <laughs> hey, we just got a girls day out. I've been working on this the entire time. You can really see how close I am. And I'm going to try and bite into it now. This is... I'm about to bite into a scorpion on camera. And everyone that ever finds this video can see it, so... It's very dry. It's it's better than I thought it would be. Oh, it's like crunchy dust. <laughs> it was so much work. <laughs> I know what a scorpion tastes like. All right, let's make another bite. Uh, we're about to go to the award ceremony. It's gonna be 
Legit. Shut up. I'm videoing. Food! <laughs> what? The bull head by the horns. Meatball? Their meatballs are really good. Put that bull by the horns. Yeah. 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 Look at that. Serious? <laughs> no way. I'd like to take this time right now. We won! We won Best Youth Feature Film at the Laughlin International Film Festival. Our film is a little crazy, a little wonky. We filmed it around town. This is not self-promotion. It's totally self-promotion. Here's a little clip. No. Uh, so the International <laughs> Laughlin, the International Laughlin Film Festival. <laughs> the Laughlin International. The Laughlin International Film Festival is a great festival for. Filmmakers to go to for opportunities, networking, networking, parties, over hundreds of films that you can watch. You can even submit your own movie like we did. You don't have to submit a feature film. You can submit a short film. You can submit a music video. You can submit a documentary or a feature film like we did because we know what we're doing. Here's a clip. No. And Lyft 2019, be there because we will be there. Hope you guys, we hope you guys enjoy this. We hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Bullet by the Horns. There are new episodes every Friday, so make sure to